Once again, this is Dick Thornburg reporting with a story that will shock and amaze you about just how far a man will go for fame and fortune. While the aftermath of this morning's daring raid on the Townsend Art Museum is still being felt, I have uncovered the bizarre life behind one of its main perpetrators. Our story begins here, in the small town of DeKalb, Illinois. Self-conscious of his immigrant heritage, Jack Frontslavsky changed his name to Frontier and joined the Army at the age of 18. Frontier had an affinity for action, and it wasn't long before the CIA had him in their sights. Yes, our government used your taxpayers' money to train this man into a skilled and lethal operative for the best part of 10 years. But Frontier eventually grew bored with this lifestyle and quit the service. Craving something more fulfilling, he recorded an exercise training video. The result was called Train or Die, a militant aerobic routine to get those perfect abs. Yes, only in America, ladies and gentlemen. Train or Die was an overnight success, and the name Frontier became synonymous with training the rich and famous. Yet even this wasn't enough for the fitness freak. Frontier wanted to star in the very action movies he helped train people for. Eventually, he got his wish in Galaxy Thief as a Martian space mercenary. The film was a surprise sleeper hit, and soon Frontier found himself reprising his role in the inevitable sequel, Galaxy Thief 2. This time, the film bombed. Many critics specifically targeting Frontier's performance, stating that not even an alien would ever act in such a wooden way. For Galaxy Thief 3, the studio wasn't taking any chances. This time, they cast heartthrob Greg Castle, hanging Jack Frontier out to dry. Forever shunned by the Hollywood elite, Jack Frontier sank into a miserable depression, once attempting suicide. The table was truly turned, ladies and gentlemen, from being toast of the town to the most wanted man in Hollywood after this morning's vicious attack. Yet another tragic tale about falling stars and shattered Hollywood dreams. How far will one man go for his 15 minutes of fame and fortune? This is Dick Thornburg signing off for HEN, where show business is your business. You don't want to go down there, but the Blades are causing havoc. The Blades? Yeah, the gang is running wild. They're armed to the teeth. Great. Well, why don't you let me handle it from here? To protect and to serve, remember! Hey, lighten up. What, do you want me to get your donut before you arrest that guy? I've had it up to here with you guys. What are you doing? Go after him. You're a cop, ain't you? Just want to check a few things first. I've had it up to here with you guys. If these guys are gang members, where are their colors? And pimps don't wear army issue boots. Oh my God! Hey, we got Everyone somebody. hide! What's, What's the matter with this guy? That's McClane. There's more of them coming. Get out of here! Uh -huh. Lane. Yeah? Get to the bank. They're fleeing. What? You're breaking up. Just get moving. They're running. See if you can cut them off. To protect and to serve, remember!
Hey, pal, what happened? Eh, bite my sack, will ya? Whoa, watch the attitude. Eh, yeah, you cops are all the same. You think you're so tough, but you're never here when we need you. Look, pal, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> well, hell, now I feel safe. You know something? If you don't shut up, I'm gonna shoot you myself. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. It's all good, I was only clowning. Is this gonna take long? Because I'm on my lunch break. Look, officer, I'd like to help, but I'm running late. Uh, can I interest you in any air conditioning? Uh, not today. Is this gonna take long? Because I'm on my lunch break. Sir, did you see what happened? Well, I was eating my lunch, and the next thing I know, here comes this kid shooting up the place. And then what? Larry gets pissed off, right? And he chases the guy out. Just don't mess with Larry. Okay, thanks. If I could ask you to wait here until we clear this up. Sure thing. You okay? Dude, this place is no fun anymore. Did you get a look at the guy who did this? No way, man. I was just starting to chow down. So you didn't see a thing? Nope. Look, man, I've just lost my appetite. Shit. Lady, you okay? My god, they're shooting at anyone! Hey, calm down, it's over, okay? God, is nowhere safe anymore? I gotta get out of this city. Just wait here for now while I clear this mess up. They're just so evil, so evil! Ma'am, are you okay? Oh my god, I am so getting out of here. If you could just stay seated for the moment. Ugh, whatever. Somewhere else? Tommy, he's creeping me out. Don't come any closer! Hold your gun down! Hey, take it easy. I'm not the only one who's having a bad day. I mean it! I warned him I was having a bad day. You okay? Yeah, yeah. I just need to get my breath back. Take deep breaths. You'll be fine. Oh shit. That was a rush. Whew. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. I just need to get my breath back. It's okay, it's over. Take deep breaths. Scum like that should be strangled at birth. Calm down, you're upsetting Mike. If I'd had my gun on me. Everyone okay? This man here, I think he's shot in the leg. Hey, McLean here. I need an ambulance at the bank. They weren't very organized. It's like they just did it for a few cheap thrills. Oh, I thought we were all dead. What a nightmare. There was nothing I could do to stop it. They weren't very organized. It's like they just did it for a few cheap thrills. Following the blood should lead you right to Look, him, John. I've done everything you've asked me to do. Now, why don't you please just leave? Hey, I decide when this is over. 
Like I decide whether you're gonna live or die. Okay, okay, you're the boss. Shut up! Now, do I kill you or let you live? Dead or alive? Oh god, please! I I have a wife. Oh, fuck you. Fine, but I'll be damned if I'm gonna clean this mess up. I don't suppose you saw an injured man come through here. Yeah, he was bleeding bad. He smashed a window and jumped out the back. Thanks. Wait here. Someone will be along in a moment. Look, I'm fine. <laughs> Holy Toledo! Somebody had some fun. Thank you, officer. You need to go down to the station and fill out a report. Yes. Okay. Um, the station. Right. Um, well, you see, officer, they... I mean, I... Look, why don't we just forget it? I don't want to cause any trouble. What? Well, you see, I'm not here. I'm not supposed to be. I'm in Atlanta. Or at least that's what my wife thinks. Look, I have to go. Nothing like saving an asshole. Right. Thank you all the same. Whoa! Easy there, John. you think, man? Nice cut? John, Let's just fly one of them alive. alive. Take them for a spin. It looks nice. Who the fuck asked you? Let them go, or your friend here is gonna lose his face. Do as he says. Put your gun down. That's better. What do you know? I don't know anything, man. You sure you got nothing for me? Nay, hey, I'm not talking. What are you boys doing here? Hmm. Just window shopping. Yeah, window shopping with guns. Bad neighborhood, right? So who are those other guys? Who are you fighting with? What? What other guys? Unless you want to spend the rest of your life eating through a tube in your nose, I suggest you stop jerking me around. Well, hold on, homeboy. We don't know who they are, but they stepped up, so they gonna pay up. Sergio wants them dead. Yo, shut up, fool! Sergio, huh? Thanks for keeping quiet. 
Who's Sergio? He, he's nobody. Well, if he's nobody, then he's not worth losing your head over. Now, who is he? I think he runs a dry cleaners around here, so... You guys had better get out of here unless you want to be lead story on tonight's news. We get the message. Hmm, just about my size. <laughs> Oops, my mistake. You're fucking dead! You're not dead, asshole. Just shut the fuck up and get this shit loaded. Yeah, you just make sure no one sees us. Hey man, how much more stuff are we gonna take? How much do you think? All of it, dumbass. Now get moving! Just sit tight and you'll live. Once the cops are gone, I'll be on my way. Dude, I don't want any trouble, all right? Shut the fuck up then, punk! Don't bother getting up. Well, Larry will be pleased. Vinny's pool hall, meeting 3 p.m. Time to get your hustle on, John. Hey, what's up? Hey, anybody strange come in here? No, but you want to hear something cool? <laughs> Only if you still stock 8-track. Um, we have a sale on gangster rap. Not what I'm looking for, thanks. Um, if you want the gangster rap, it's over there. Down below, like below the counter. Hey, listen, I'm not interested in... Die, motherfucker! Oh, I get it. Yeah, very clever. Well, Larry will be pleased. You okay? <laughs> I am now, man. Vinny's pool Take hall, whatever you want, dude. No charge. PM. Time to get your hustle on. McLean, where are you? I'm at Vinyl Fantasy. You can tell Fat Larry I bagged his bad guy. I read you. We'll send over a van. I think you're gonna need more than one. I sense something big is going down. Roger that. Just keep us posted. Membership card. Here you go. What do you want here? Well, I ain't here to play pool. I'm delivering something for your boss. And who might that be? Sergio. Hmm. <laughs> okay, but I suggest you don't speak unless spoken to. They don't like new faces in here. You got the gear? Yep. Get a drink. Be what you would man. Let's get moving. Hey. Right. Nice. Just fuck 
Chopper's a threat, man! from the Townsend. Keys to the picture house. Guess it's time to see what movie's playing. Did your mom tell you to stay away from the construction sites? 